Oh, yep, yep, yep. Oh my god, this is bigger. This is way bigger. Way bigger. Oh, don't get in the tree. Don't get in the tree. Don't get in the tree. Oh, shit. Oh. All right, guys, I'm out here today on another solo mission. I got the fly rod, and I am after a very specific species, a species that has tormented us since we started fly fishing. Oh, oh, there he is. Oh, no. Got it, he got it. What a fish. What a, no. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, oh my God, dude. Oh, no. This fish is big strong and it's got a nasty set of teeth which makes it really hard to catch on a fly rod but today i came prepared i got the eight weight some thicker line and i'm hoping that i can land it there are massive fish in this pond big bass and big species that i'm chasing not gonna give it away but hopefully i'm gonna show you so i'm gonna get after it hope i don't lose another one wish me luck the bite turns on a little later so hoping that i can get him to bite earlier today the water's down. It's not easy to cast here and it's not easy to set the hook here. So that is a problem. But I'll get it figured out. Gotta run parallel to the bank, which makes hook setting properly really a pain to be honest. It's important to strip set. It's really important to strip set. On my fly of choice, it's a fly that we I've used before. So I'll throw in the candy man. It's an articulated fly with two hooks. One problem with these fish, they have a bony mouth. So I'm hoping more hooks means more chances to, to stick one. God dang, I love the wind. Nope. <clears throat> All right, going down here. <laughs> Caught a bass here yesterday. And there's stuff swimming around, it's probably turtles. But if I have to battle one on here, it's going to be freaking sketchy. I'm shaky right now. Yep, yep, yep. To both in. To both in. 
Oh, he's fighting good. Siege. Oh, don't get in the tree, don't get in the tree, don't get in the tree. Oh, he's got blue fins, dude. His fins are blue. That's wicked. Ah, uh, no, I don't think so. Whoa. Let's go. Let's go, bowfin on the fly rod. Let's go, dude. Look at his fins. Check that out. Let's go. Not a big. But that's a success right there. I hope y'all could see the colors on that thing. Cause that is wild. Here she is. I'm guessing it's, well, no, it's probably a he. Those fins being bright blue like that. Probably something to do with mating. I had to do some research, but they're like turquoise blue. Hope we can see that on camera. But uh, yeah, both in on the fly, baby, let's go. No longer skunked on the fly rod. This is a species that I haven't been over the land on the fly rod. And this one is beautiful. Ah, look at that orange flamey tail blue fins got the cat paw on it we'll know if we catch this one again because it'll have the same spots but that's amazing ah, i'm gonna try to catch a bigger one though because this one's small for out here all right i don't think you're a trash fish oh nice let's go catch a bigger one man that was crazy that was dope that was fun that was the first fish that i i wasn't sure if i was gonna land it uh like i was scared he's gonna break off the entire time but Fair enough. Yep, 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 yep. Oh my God, this is bigger. This is way bigger, way bigger. Oh, please don't. No, 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 no. Stay out of the tree, stay out of the tree, stay out of the tree. I gotta get off this tree. Oh shit. Stay out, stay out, stay out, stay out. No, no, no. Oh, he's got me wrapped up. I don't know what to do. Oh, I don't know if I can go out here. Oh shit! Oh. I know you're not supposed to grab the line, but I don't know what to do in this scenario. No! No! Damn! He broke off. Shit!
Well, that was something. All right, that was by far the most intense fishing action I've ever had. I, the water's not deep, but the mud is probably like, I mean, I'm wet up to my waist. So, I mean, it was a lot deeper than I thought it was. I'm bleeding, got mud everywhere, and he took my fly. That was the last candy man we had. So, I got another one of our favorites, the meat whistle, which is just a cone head. Doesn't have two hooks, so I'm gonna have to get my hook set right. But, I'm gonna go back out there, and I'm gonna catch a big one, because he was huge. Twice the size of the other one, so, I'm gonna get after him. All right, well, that was probably one of the most interesting days of fishing I've ever had. I've been in the water quite a few times, but uh, that that was a little scarier than normal. I didn't know what I was gonna do if I did get a hold of that fish. Uh, you can't lip uh, both ends, so even though I lost the big one, I did catch one on the fly, which means we broke the streak of losing both ends on the fly. We finally made it happen. It was a gorgeous both fin. Gotta catch a big one, so I'm not giving up. I'll be back out here eventually to land the big one. But all in all, it was a good day. And remember, all it takes is one, baby. Slab out.